Welcome to Ragnarok Games. How about my new intro? Pretty good, eh? Bit long, but it's a work in progress. Don't get me wrong, it's a work in progress, but uh, I, I, I love it. <laughs> it's got all the best bits of um, the things I like. There's certain things I've realized. I keep going on about Dark Tide, and I've realized. I don't have any videos out about Dark Tide, so I might as well just do a quick trailer review. Because, you know, content. <laughs> so what have I got? I just want to go through the trailer first. Uh, we'll watch it together. I've already, obviously I've watched it. You've probably watched it already because it's been a long time. <laughs> a long time and we've been waiting for it. But, uh, Put it on, and we'll go. I just want to go through a few things that that I've noticed personally. <sighs> Bloody Xbox! Yes, we get it. Xbox gets it before PlayStation. Thank you. Right, I'm gonna shut up now. Yeah, I'll shut up. Coming 2021, that. <clears throat> right. There's so much happening in that in that trailer we were given. It gives us so many answers, but it also gives us so many more questions. Like, at one point you see around the guardsman's neck he's he's got like a medallion of the inquisition i actually just noticed it in that watch through there so i'm going off the cuff here but i did read somewhere that they are agents of the inquisition here we go you see on his neck there 
that's, an, that's the symbol of the Inquisition. He's a guardsman of the Inquisition. This is the Dark Tide website, right? You got PC Gamer December 2020 edition. Read the article, the article's nothing. Related news, not much. This is it. This is it on the website. You then click on news, thinking there must be something. Four articles. There's four articles. Uh, yeah, Dan Abnett talks about it. Uh, I think we find out that the the hive city that they're in is called Terridge Room. I'll have to do a separate video where, where we watch through that. Gameplay trailer. It's just not enough. One thing that does come out of this one, though, was the, um, this picture here. Um, obviously, we see four characters in the trailer. In Vermintide 2, uh, we have five characters. And in this picture, there is a, a character with, like, a, a hood, a cloak, and maybe a sniper rifle. I mean, does that mean we're getting another character that we haven't seen yet? Or is there going to be... Multiple other characters? I really hope so. Because um, it's 40k. There's so much we could have. We could have, we could have a, not a tech marine. Just a tech priest. Oh, it's... There should be more news by now. We're in 2022 now. The Ogrins... I thought this was a grenade launcher. Because uh, some of the Bulgrins have grenade launchers. They look a lot different to that though. But at, there's a scene at the beginning uh, where the Ogryn basically uses it like a shotgun, sort of. Alright. The Ogryn is carrying this grenade launcher. Looks like a grenade launcher. I think he uses it like a grenade launcher. But then in this scene here let me just go back and Touch. He fires that close range. Like, so is it a grenade launcher or is it a shotgun? Ah, this. Oh, I need to. I want people to come in the comments and talk to me so we can discuss this. Discuss this game. I speak about this game non-stop in my live streams. I'm talking about... I mean, look! 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 Can I zoom in, please? That tells me he's got a flamethrower. Because you don't see that in the game. Obviously, this could be concept art. We, as we all know, concept art looks completely different to the final image but we need more fat shark if you if you're listening to your fans we need more information i go into the discord server and at one point all i said was anyone else concerned about the lack of news and the amount of abuse i got for just asking that question. Oh, we've been over this a million times. Ah, all right, well, I haven't discussed it. Somebody tell me. People are getting agitated. Uh, as you can probably tell, I'm agitated, but that's just because I'm so excited for it. I want to be the Ogryn. I just want to play. At least give us the minimum requirements we need, because, as I've said before, my PC is pretty shit. So, I need to get it upgraded before it comes out, because I will be getting it on the PC. Because uh, I'm not waiting an, an extra year for it to come out on PlayStation. Forget that noise. Anyway, that's all I wanted to talk about. I wanted to have the trailer out there do a quick review of it 
I love the trailer. I've watched it multiple times. There's so much in there that I would love to talk about. If there's anything you want to talk about, come join me in my streams. Especially on a Wednesday. It's Warhammer Wednesday. Um, if there's anything you want to if there's anything you want to talk about, or uh, about Dark Tide, or is there anything you think that should be made aware to me, write it down in the comments. And I want to do more videos on Dark Tide before it comes out. Let's discuss the weapons. Let's discuss the enemies. Let's discuss what we think the characters will do. Let's discuss the types of classes we're gonna have. So um, yeah. Follow me on twitch.tv forward slash Ragnarok Games. Uh, if you haven't already, like and subscribe to the uh, channel, to my YouTube channel. As you can see in the corner there, I have uh, my affiliate goal at 41, which I'm really excited about. Um, only nine more to go. But the hard one is the average views. I need you guys, I need you, the people to come and talk to me during my stream I want to discuss Dark Tide. let's talk about the weapons let's talk about the characters what kind of classes we're going to have between you and me I reckon the Ogryn is going to be a Bulgrin there's going to be a Bulgrin class where he becomes a tank oh I can't wait um yeah so, like and subscribe, and uh, I'll see you in the next one. Bye.